My name is Jai Tracy, and today we're going to be learning about the electrifying theater profession called the Master Electrician. Ha! Huh, you get it? Electrifying. The Master Electrician is one of the most important professions that has become such an integral part of all levels of theatrical production today. But how did this profession come about? I'm sure the ancient Greeks all the way to the mobile theaters in medieval times didn't have electric power generators lying around. When did the theater scene shift from flames to electricity? Okay, so imagine that you're in 19th century England. The year is 1879 and you just beat Joseph Small to patenting your revolutionary invention, the electric lamp. You would be Thomas Edison, by the way. Edison's invention marked the beginning of modern stage lighting through his invention of the incandescent bulb. Many theaters in England, like the Savoy Theater in 1881 and around the world, began to adopt these bulbs due to the amount of control that directors could now have over the lighting to enhance the plot and atmosphere of their productions for the audience. Due to popular use of electric lighting in theaters worldwide, a new position was created to manage this new theatrical technology. This position is called the Chief or Master Electrician. The Master Electrician is the theater's charge electrician. Also known as the Head Electrician, the Master Electrician is responsible for maintaining and operating the theater's lighting equipment, managing the lighting budget, and hiring the necessary crews to complete the tasks of hanging, focusing, running, and striking individual productions. Between productions, the master electrician will ensue, ensure that the electrics department and its equipment is organized in proper working condition, guaranteeing that spare parts and replacement lamps are in stock. The master electrician will also be sure that the proper gel or color is available, and any other materials specified by the designer, such as pattern templates, also known as gobos, irises, and sidearms. If necessary, the master electrician will oversee any rigging that may need to be accomplished in order to successfully carry out the design. Taking it back in time, in the Italianate staging during the 16th through 18th centuries, an early form of artificial lighting control was famously perfected and employed by Italian architect Nicola Sabatini. He would also use candle and oil lamps, chandeliers, and invent the spotlight. Sabatini can be thought of as the first master electrician despite his use of candles because of the nature of his work in light control. Nicola Sabatini in 1638 published a manual for constructing theatrical scenes and machines. Moving further in time, Robert Christian was an important figure in the field who held lighting designer and master electrician positions at Chicago's Goodman Theater. Throughout the 1970s, Kristen designed and ran lighting for some of the most successful productions in Chicago theater history, including the world premiere of American Buffalo, A Life in the Theater, Marvin's Room, and A Christmas Carol. Kristen's technical genius has been attributed by his contemporaries to maintaining the original Goodman theaters past its use by date. He was also responsible for creating the lighting architecture for the Albert and Owen theaters. Bring it to modern times, a popular contemporary master electrician is Brandon Quigley, most famous for his long-running head electrician position on the Broadway production Wicked. Quigley has been very instrumental in pushing lighting technology forward. In an interview with LiveDesignOnline.com in 2018, Quigley mentions how he promoted Wicked's shift to LED from incandescent bulbs, and he also claimed to have the very first Philips Very Light VL3000 spots ever manufactured. So, chasing the bleeding edge of technology is a part of the Wicked experience, according to Quigley. Some important terms that you would want to know in addition to master electrician are lighting designers and electrician. During the planning stages and tech processes, the master electrician is the lighting designer's right hand man, responsible for putting the paperwork of the designer into action, supplied with a light plot, instrument schedule, and channel hookup, the master electrician compiles all the necessary equipment and makes a plan for how to organize the work that will need to be done. Hmm, this job sounds pretty interesting. I wonder what it would be like. Okay, Joe. I need you to coordinate your electricians to focus three lights on Mary during her solo. Gotcha, Kevin. And where's her solo again? I just want to double check uh, my instructions so I can inform all the theater house electricians. Her solo is during Act 3, Scene 5. Make sure that the lights are red because I want to evoke a menacing ambiance that fits the playwright's vision. Yes, sir.
I'll make sure that that. I'm on it. Wow, that seems pretty interesting. Some relevant qualifications to become a master electrician include uh, having your bachelor's or relevant experience, um, knowledge of Vectorworks, Lightrite or similar CAD software, general knowledge of dimming controlling systems, as well as appropriate electrical load balancing. You need basic knowledge of rigging for electrics. Um, the salary range for master electricians according to Glassdoor.com um, nationally is around 48000 some other duties include planning and implementing of the cabling or circuiting of lights and electric power distribution for any given show or production, inventory and repair and maintenance of all stage lighting, fixtures, cables, effects, power distribution, dimmers, networking, and lighting control consoles, organization and purchasing of all consumable including gels, gobos, and gaff tape, documenting and tracking all of the scenery circuiting, addressing, and system configuration in cooperation with the lighting designer. If there are no light board ops, the master electrician may need to patch the board according to the lighting director's designs or the lighting designer's designs. Solving any problems or issues with the electrical equipment that the deck electricians cannot resolve by themselves. Um, master electricians also uh, function in occupational safety and health workers and operational decisions as head of the electrics department. So, um, I hope you learned a lot about, you know, the profession of master electrician work. Um, this profession is definitely here to stay as technology gets better and as we, you know, advance our lighting technologies. Um, we move from incandescent light bulbs to LEDs with the rise of technology and automation. Um, soon this job might be able to be completely ran by computers um, with things like the metaverse and things like that. Um, there could be things like a virtual reality theater, um, which will come into play and lighting, lighting is here to stay and lighting direction is here to stay. So uh, thank you so much. This, uh, thank you for watching this video on uh, Master Electrician Profession. Uh, my name is Jolly Tracy and I hope you learned a lot. Thank you.